Hey guys, take control with the video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to quickly fix your iPhone if your iPhone is frozen, you can't touch the screen, it's not working. This is the very first step in troubleshooting that you want to do and it will resolve pretty much most of the issue if you have it is around software on your iPhone. So here I have the iPhone 14 Pro here, but if you have iPhone 8 or the 8 Plus and above, anything newer, you're going to do this method. The method is going to be really simple. It's going to be a sequence of buttons, so you're going to do press and release the volume up, press and release the volume down, and you're going to hold the side button until the screen goes completely black and you see the Apple logo reappear. So to do it in real time, volume up, volume down, and then you're going to hold the side button just like that until the screen goes completely black. And what we're doing is known as a force restart, and the very first troubleshooting step when it comes to resolving any software related issue on your iPhone. So as you can see here, Apple logo reappear, I let go of that button. Again, volume up, followed by volume down one after another, and then you hold that side button just the way I showed you. And this method is for iPhone 8 and above, so anything newer you have on your phone. On the back of my other screen, you'll see here two different other types of phone I have. So if you have iPhone 7 or the 7 Plus, the method is gonna be slightly different on that version. So for the iPhone 7 or the 7 Plus, what you're going to do is hold this side button and the volume down button on your left hand side at the same time. So if your screen is frozen, press these two buttons at the same time. So we're going to do it again one more time. The This is known as a wake or the sleep button and then the volume down button. Just like that. And you're going to keep on holding it just the way I did, as you can see, the screen went black. Keep on holding it until you see the Apple logo reappear. And we let go once we see the Apple logo appear. And same thing as doing a force restart, which should, again, clear up any issues, especially if your screen is frozen and isn't working. And again, this method will not delete any of your personal data on your phone, so you don't have to worry about that. And just wait till you get back to the main screen. Finally, if you have an iPhone 6, S or anything older, you're going to follow this method, which is going to be holding the side button here, the power button here, and then the home button at the same time. So what it will do is, again, we'll hold this side button and the home button at the same time if it's frozen or doesn't work. And again, same exact thing. You see where I press and hold these two buttons again till the screen goes black and I wait for the Apple logo to appear. I let go of that button again. Now that's a forced restart on the iPhone. 6s or anything older so these are going to be the different method you want to apply depending on your iphone that you have most likely you'll follow the first method which was volume up and down and then the side button for iphone 8 and above but if you do have older version the same method applies and after that you should resolve your issue if your screen is frozen and wasn't working now if you're still having issues where the screen is frozen and still doesn't work after you have done this and now the other thing you could do is try to charge the phone if your battery is low or if you can let the phone completely die and then wait to recharge it again. What that will do is recalibrate the battery and the software as well. And finally, if none of these work, most likely there's an issue with the LCD or the display of your iPhone. In that case, you'll need to take it to Apple Store and get it replaced. So I hope this video was helpful. If so, please make sure to like and subscribe button. Thanks for watching, guys. See you guys next time.